It's not a particular characteristic or quality or social circumstance. This is about history being made applicable, approachable and live. I think it's a selflessness and a activities that bring about uh, a more positive future. And that they continue to do so while they are still alive. To make meaning of one's life, it, it has to be more than just your own personal self-gain. And you never give up. You own the need to make that call, that effect happen. If you know who you are, you're going to see clearly where you're going. Zazi, Zithonipe, respect yourself. Zitande, love yourself. We need to continue and to pass on to others that which our experience has taught us. 1994 has given us the opportunity for all to share the experiences of each community so that it becomes the experience of the entire community. Help remind other people of their power. There is definitely power within all of us. And for me, as a living legend, I'm going to actually make that more. Durban is unique in that, in that it holds these Living Legends Award. I know of no other city in, the, in South Africa that does this. And I think for the children, um, for people that are possibly at some sort of disadvantage, I think seeing that these are real human beings, they're still living, they're active, they're proactive, they care about people that are suffering, they, they want to alleviate poverty. I think collectively, one hopes that this sort of living history will encourage others to do the same. In order to be able to resolve issues, in order to be able to solve problems, you must first own that problem. Don't blame anybody else. Own the problem yourself and say, not only do I own the problem, but I also own their solution. I'm going to go and get that solution. I think this award will and is definitely encouraging other people. When they look at us, they can say to themselves, it is possible, it can be done. It's when we understand that everything is connected, we are connected as human beings to everybody else, that we begin to see that our well-being is integrally connected to the well-being of other people. Kind of like everything is open, we must move with the Renaissance idea and know that there's more power when we are one. That potential is limitless. That given our geographical situation, given our shared culture and our histories, we must aspire. Uh, the sky is no limit. Whatever you feel you want to do, if you're driven by your passion, if you're driven by your heart, you're going to go out there and do it. I'm looking at every detail that, that's been put together for this event to happen, to just say thank you. And you know, it's, oh my gosh. Thank you, Teguini. Thank you, Maya. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.